Good morning. It's the morning after the night before. It is. <coughs> it's probably quite late. It's nearly 10 o'clock. I've had a bit of a lie in. I've been and had a shower. Uh, the facilities are really good at this place. And Helen's just gone now. So when she gets back, I'm going to do a sausage sandwich or something like that. And then we're going to go and uh, I've spoke to the gentleman who runs this place, really nice chap. And he said I can leave the van here a bit longer. Well, for rest of the day, because uh, they've not got any many bookings. So we're going to have a, a look around Liverpool and today is going to be a day of culture. I'm really looking forward to it. That was one of the best pub crawls we've ever done last night. It was absolutely fantastic. I've got some sausages from Morrison. Bloody Morrison's. Don't like Morrison's. Uh, and I've bought this from as to this air fryer, £22. So I'm just going to do sausage and egg sandwich. I'll fry some eggs on there. I almost forgot the coffee. So I've got the, the kettle on as well. But we're using a lot of power there, look. Uh, 1930 odd watts. So, what he's managing. Like an idiot, I forgot oil and I forgot sauce, like ketchup or brown sauce. So I'm having to do the egg. I've got some of that spray oil, but that's no good really. So I'm having to do that. It's better than nothing. But no sauce. I can't believe I've not got any sauce. She's taking forever, so I'm gonna have my sandwich. Uh, made myself a coffee. And uh, I'll have mine and then I'll, I'll just put her egg in when she gets here. I'm quite pleased with that. Sausage and egg sandwich, all right, it's got no sauce on. It's got salt and pepper though. Uh, I, I like to flip my egg because I don't want to be getting egg yolk all down me. Nice cup of coffee. I'll have to, uh, Helen's sausages are in the air fryer, just staying warm and I'll make hers when she gets here. I'm going to chuck in and enjoy this now. Somebody's on paracetamol. No, I've got a pain in the neck. I know, she's not, she weren't drunk, It's called James. <laughs> So, what do you think of your little... Uh, she don't want bread. She's a bit funny with bread, is Ellen. So she's got... I'm doing low carbs. She says. How many <laughs> pints did you have last night? In a they pie. Don't, they don't count. So that was your night off, for it, last night? Yeah, have you got a knife, please? Oh, God, she won't, don't want much, do you? Yet again. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? What is it with wind? <laughs> These last couple of weeks, the wind has been shocking. Look at those people on the bikes. I feel sorry for them. Wow, it's that windy, it's blowing my scarf off. It's pandemonium, Ellen. So all along here... Look at that. People have put the padlocks to profess their undying love. That's quite a fancy padlock. I like that one. Yeah, it's a cracker, that one. That's my favourite one up it's to now. favourite padlock. There was a heart-shaped one, all intricate, back there. That was a good one. What yes. did you say? It's the symbol of their love. Yeah, there was somebody who was expressing their love for JD Gyms, wasn't there? Yeah, they put their gym uh, the padlock, gym padlock on padlock thing because they love it. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know this kind of wind, it could just blow you off your feet. Yeah. I'm often a critic of modern architecture, but I do like that building. Because it, it fits in, doesn't it? What do you like about it? I don't, I don't know, it's just, it just a, it's shiny? Just a, I like shiny things. <laughs> <laughs> it sort of gives lots of different reflections of the other buildings. Yeah, it's not a monstrosity, is it? It's not like a grey concrete... No, it's... I saw. That is beautiful. I wonder what that is. Is it Town Hall, do you think, or something? Look at that one ahead there with the red brick top. That's almost like sort of Bavarian, isn't it? Yeah, I know what you mean, yeah. Are we going to go in and see some art? Where yeah. is the art? Over there. 
Oh, to here, yeah, here we are. Well, that was crap. Yeah, it was. Tate, modern, it were absolute rubbish. Yeah, so... <laughs> right, basically, it's the Tate Moderns moved from its original building near the water because they are renovating it. So there's, like, nothing to the, look at there. There is absolutely nothing in other than they've they just put a load of Lego for people to play with, for some ear play with some like, I could have done a better gallery than that, really, in my shed. I ain't even got a shed. <laughs> I could have got a shed, piled some Lego up, said, come play with this Lego, and done a projector on the wall, look at this, all about the green future. Everything's got to be about the green stuff, has not it? You know, I'm not moaning, though, but we're going to go to a proper gallery. We're going to go to the Walker Gallery and look at some proper art. <laughs> she really makes me laugh, does Ellen, and this is why I love her so much, because she's just so naturally funny. So we stood at the crossing down there. There must have been bu busy main road. There must have been 20 people stood there, and not one person just thought to press a button. And this man in front of us pressed the button, he realised, and he pressed button. And I said, I can't believe we've all just stood here and nobody's even pressed button. And what did you say? You said, oh, yeah, well, that man pressed it. He's our leader. <laughs> and then his wife said, oh, bloody hell, don't follow him. <laughs> the cavern. Well, I'll take your picture if you like. You can move on filming. I'll take oh, you. Moon. Yeah. <laughs> so that's the Cavern Pub. Where's the Cavern Club then? That's Sergeant. This is it. No, that's not the club, is this it? This is the, the sister, sister pub, pub to the Cavern oh, Club. Opposite. The cav <laughs> It's holiday apartments. It's here. All right. We've got a restaurant. What do you do? Do you pay to go in? Are you five like, oh, it's live music today. Yeah. Can you just go in or do you have to pay? It's five pounds to come in, babe. Do you have live music on all day? Oh, all right, OK. Yeah, we've got to comb it to the law, isn't it? Yeah. It's a long way down. We're going to have a... Oh, oh it's is... really down in... <laughs> out of the cavern club oh, what you think? I what loved it yeah it? yeah we couldn't there was a guy singing singing Beatles songs it was really good but obviously because of the copyright situation with YouTube I'll have to or you'll have seen it already I'll have had to put some other music some sort of sound alike music or something but you get idea don't you anyway what are you looking at diamond bracelets <laughs> how cool's that Oh, Scylla. Do you think that's actual height? That's not actual height. Mind you, she's got heels on. Stand beside her. No, no. She might really be that Right, big. she must have been a giant. <laughs> Answers in the comments. Was Scylla Black a giant? You might... <laughs> that's not life-size, no. Oh, 
Well, you're that YouTuber, aren't you? I am, yes. Yeah. Nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you. I'll yeah. see you now and again, Mike. All right. You're still in your van, We bumped into a subscriber called Charlie. Uh, Hi, Charlie. Nice to meet you, mate. Yeah. Let's sort of see, we've got subscribers everywhere. Yeah, it's obviously a very... There's great pubs around there's here. There's some right pubs, yeah. aren't there? We need to come back pubs. here again at night. But all, a lot of the pubs like this. Hey Jude. <laughs> oh, that's not a pub. Hair and Beauty. And then you've got Strawberry Fields there. Ahead. There's just Beatles stuff everywhere. Don't buy me love. Oh, can't buy me love. Can't buy me love. You know it's recording, yeah? Is it? Remember, you've got a microphone. On. Oh, sorry. So, like, Helen's always singing to herself and she forgets <laughs> that it's recording. Uh, yeah, you'll probably pick me up talking to myself as Ooh, well. White Star, didn't somebody tell us about oh. the White Star pub? So we're gonna have a look. Although we need to go to this. We, didn't we go to one called the White Star? We went to Star. another White Star, but maybe. Oh no, we went to the White Heart. White Heart. Did somebody say the no, White Star? No, he said White Star, and then he corrected yeah. himself and said White Heart. All oh, right, yeah, but that looks interesting. It doesn't does, it? yeah, yeah, that looks nice. That's my kind of place. Oh look, it's got a bit of history. I'm gonna have a look through the. The uh, back room of the pub was used by the Beatles. But it's got some real ales on. Ah. Oh, look, he's twinned with the White Star in the Czech Republic. There you go. Are you alright? It's a girl on YouTube. Yeah, it is now. Hey, hey. <laughs> what's your <laughs> name? Sorry, Turner. And what's your favourite thing about Liverpool? The What's your favourite thing? Buildings. The abandoned buildings. Is there some good abandoned, abandoned buildings? buildings. One over there. Is there? Yeah, Is that where you've there. just come from? No, we're going later. Oh, you're going? Nice yeah, one. Alright, have fun. See ya. Fine statues, aren't they? There's lots of them, isn't there? There's a there? lot of statues, yeah. Everywhere. Right. I think we're in this direction. We. <laughs> Wanting to look around the Walker Art Gallery, which is a magnificent building, much like the museum over there and that big round thing. Oh, look, it's there. That is. It's called in scaffolding. Look at that, the theatre there, Helen. Watch yourself. What? I thought you were going to walk into those people. But it, it looks... Oh, it's as open as usual. I'm glad. Let's hope it's better than Tate. <laughs> That was a letdown. Yeah. Helen has a very keen interest in pre Raphaelite art, don't you? Yes. So, so we're coming to look I at I like that. Botticelli. <laughs> we don't know what we're saying, really. <laughs> no, but I do <laughs> like Botticelli. Is Botticelli pre Raphaelite? I don't know, it's Italian. It's we're just Italian. trying to come across as intelligent. Yeah, I like the birth of Venus. That's yeah. one of his very famous I paintings. I like ones with naked ladies on. Do you? Well, yeah. that's got a naked lady. Has it? Yeah. Right, let's go in. <laughs> let's have a look. Some wonderful paintings in there, some of the old stuff. And some wonderful <laughs> sculptures in, in marble. The, the, the sculptures were amazing. Uh, but, you know, we like art, don't we? But yeah. some of the modern art, it is a it's case just, of... It's like a joke, It's basically. Emperor's... Uh, what is it, Emperor's New Clothes or something? They just do, like, squiddles or just do a, a blob and... And then they come up with some waffle, don't they, to try yeah, and justify they, it? Some, it was uh, trying to invoke the raw emotion. Dare I say the, BS? Yeah. Yeah. And then there was one that had won a load of money for this 
bag of shite, basically. <laughs> and then this put. Uh, he plans on spending the, the winnings on uh, further enriching his art through travel. And we're like, <laughs> bullshit! <laughs> yeah, he's, he's going just, on he's holiday! Going, <laughs> he's just going on a mass piss up on holiday. Yeah. We're just wandering down this street here and looking up at all the architecture. There's lots of interesting things. There's another lovely building here. What's this? Oh, the, is that the vines? I wonder if that, isn't that one oh, of the pubs? Oh, it is, the vines. Oh, gosh. So we have like the quickest half we've ever yeah. had. Yeah. Hey, look, Britannia Adelphi Hotel. Is that that oh. terrible hotel? Uh, that people well, say alleged, it's really bad? Well, allegedly. But it's in a good spot, isn't it? We wow, were gonna, look at it! We were going to stay there. It's massive! Come on. Uh, Let's right, have we're going to have to be quick, Alan. We're going to have to be really quick. Go on then. Oh, oh let me go wow, in with it. Wow, look oh, at yeah. this! Wow, this is. Look at that moon. That moon. Yeah. Oh, wow. Sorry. It's not a bad little pub, is it? Wow, really? look at that, look at that. Can you imagine the maintenance? I mean, they'll have to get that fixed eventually. There going up. Oh, they've got a good spot. You know, like these doorways, look how like, thick they are. Look at them freezers there. Oh, look, it's the little bells again. It's very nice. Isn't uh, it? Do you know the little that you press? Oh, yeah, the buttons. Bling, bling. You've got the best spot there, haven't you? <laughs> 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 yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Yeah, good pub this. Really like this pub. We've we've been in so many good pubs. That wind I've got that window behind me so it might be a bit dark. It might be dark. It's a shame we're running out of time. So much to do because there's another pub we want to go and look at, isn't there? I don't know how far that is. We want to look at the cathedral and we want to look at the uh, Georgian Street, don't we? And then we'll need to get something to eat at some point. I know, I'm starting to feel a bit peckish, are you? Yeah, yeah. That was the quickest half a pint I've ever had. But was I just it? To, Well, I wanted to go in and have a look at that place. We can see the cathedral. There's somebody shouting outside the Adelphi. <laughs> <laughs> it's like the one in... The Britannia Hotel in Scarborough, when we got there, there was somebody shouting outside. <laughs> it, it's sort of a bit of an ominous... A little bit. Uh, yeah. <laughs> shouting. What to expect. Get this geezer up here. Just, just have a look. Wow. This is good. This I is like cool. It. So, oh, it's Turkish and stuff. So it's not all Chinese, Mexican. Uh, no, Turkish, Chinese, sushi. We might come back here later. Yeah. What we'll thing? Come on then. I'll tell you what, Heli Bobs. Yeah. Let's go down this way. Look, it says open. That's not the cathedral. That's just what a, is it? That's just like a ruins. That's that's the cathedral's behind it. What is that then? Just a church? Yeah, it's like an old derelict church. Welcome to the bombed out church. Oh, so we're going to have a look? Yeah. Right? We've just had a Helen classic. Hey, <laughs> look at the timbers, they're the all... Oh yeah, look at the timber. They're all so bits. burnt. Let me tell you what Helen's just said. Oh, stop it. So we come in and they said, do you want to have a look round that You give them a donation, you can have a look round the bombed out church. And it was bombed during the war. And yeah, Helen but says, which war though? Helen says, who bombed it? It what Mexicans love. <laughs> <laughs> Get them stuff! Them bloody Mexicans. She's picked up something to read. 
but it was an incendiary device that landed just after midnight round the back of the building, apparently, and obviously the fire completely gutted it. Such a shame, such a beautiful old building. You, you've got it upside down, love. All right, it's upside down on this side. Oh, yeah, I'm just pretending to read. <laughs> I thought you were doing it to look intellectual. Yeah, I've got my thing upside down. I can't actually read. Tell so, me something. The, um, the foundation stone was laid in April of 1811. By the way, I asked the man, did anyone get killed or injured? Do you know when the bomb fell on the church? And no one did. Fortunately. Fortunately. That's good. And it happened after midnight. I've just said all that. In May 1941. Well, anyway, the Earl of Derby gave this land to Liverpool under the instruction that only a church was would be Was that built. the Earl of Derby that was executed outside the pub in Bolton? <gasps> I mean, there's lots of hills of Derby. Know. I wonder it what could year be. it was. It could be. James. What, darling? Do you know in World War Two, Liverpool yeah. was uh, one of the heaviest bombed cities yeah. in the country, apart from London. Yeah, was it? Yeah. Well, because it was of a lot of importance, yeah. really, wasn't it, with all the shit work. The city was affected by a devastating seven night bombardment known as the May Blitz. Just after midnight on the 6th of May 1941, the church was struck by an incendiary bomb. You've said that, haven't you? Yeah. By approximately 3.36, the time at which the clock stopped. Is this still It's not there. Uh, the fire ascended the tower, causing several of the bells to cascade to the ground yeah. while the building masonry shell remains largely intact its interior of roof structure and was almost entirely destroyed oh dear it says cathedral entrance so is it no, that big entrance it's there? this side yeah it's it's a bit the, the sign postage is not very good that's my first complaint <laughs> And my second complaint is we walked past this late last night, didn't we? Did we? Yeah, and it weren't... Oh, my God. We walked past this late last night and it weren't lit up or anything. It looked a bit... Oh, you said that, didn't I you? I said, I'm surprised it weren't lit up, such an iconic building. But it is huge. I mean, when you stand here underneath you, you really get to appreciate the scale. They've still got nativity there, Alan. So, yeah, Georgian houses, all this. Look at that street. That's where we walked along. Oh, is that the other cathedral? Yeah, that's the other cathedral there, which is another sort of famous landmark when you're coming to Liverpool. I just don't have energy to walk it, do you? Yeah. Oh, hell yeah. I always have the energy. But I thought we would to look at these Georgian houses. All right, quickly, them's your Georgian houses. Look at the street lights, some gorgeous properties. We're going further away from Van going that way, you know. Some lovely big old properties. What way do you want to go? Shall we go down there? Come on, let's go. It's going to be dark in a minute, so. What way? You, you tell me what way you want to go. Where's the van? The van is in that direction. Because we've seen the Georgian houses last night. Yeah, I'm on about just people haven't seen them though. But you get the idea. 
there and there's a load more it's very beautiful I can only show so much I can't show people everything so we have a look at that cathedral over there or is that is that too far oh, do you want to go for some dinner dinner please come on then uh, she's given up what do you mean given she's up she's given up she's not got the stamina I've got If you're coming to Liverpool, you need three or four days, don't you? You do. I mean, we've not even hardly seen any of it. We've not seen much at all. <laughs> Look at that property. <laughs> Oh, it's beautiful. It's a lovely house. That's what sort of house we want into, Ellen. Yeah, I don't think we'll ever get <laughs> We're one. We're never going to get no, one. But not if, really. If, when me and Helen win lottery, <laughs> we're going to have a Georgian no, house. No, darling, I've already won the lottery. Because oh. I've met you. Happy head. Happy head. Yeah. Look at it from there. Oh, yeah. It's magnificent, isn't it? It really is. It's got to be one of the biggest cathedrals, that. Oh, I can hear, I can feel a Beatles song coming on. Can't buy me love. Money can't buy me love, All you right. see. So well, when I say that uh, I've already won... We're having won, parallel conversations here, No, you? you see, I'm still on the last conversation still... thinking. Ellen works on a bit of a delay, <laughs> so whenever we're going somewhere, she's always behind. Unless it's a pub, then she's... <laughs> <laughs> She's just on different time zones. <laughs> and occasionally they do match. And that's when we sort of interact. In tune. <laughs> <laughs> but there'll be conversations. I've moved on to the next conversation and she's answering questions from conversation previously. Right, look at that picture. I don't know if it's going to work on camera, but... Wow. Does that work? Yeah, it works for me. It's like an optical illusion, it's like it's moving. Let's try again. I don't think it works on... But if, if you get close up, you can see that they're on like... Uh, it's an effect, isn't it? It's really clever. It's just a flat picture. It's not flat, it's, it protrudes through Oh places. gosh, it does! So, I don't know if you make it out on camera, but as you walk down, it moves, the picture moves. It's like one of those pictures, you know, where you have to squint and then, it, that? like, a fish appears or something. Is that working? So, this is the final pub, that's where we wanted to come. Is it an old police station or something? So, we're going to have a look. I think everyone's coming out to watch football tonight, so... We might not. We'll go and have a look inside. All right, so that's pretty cool. But we're not going to get a seat, are we? So... <coughs> yeah, they're, they're all like prison cells. They all used to be prison cells and they've all got football on. It's a cracking idea for people that want to watch football. Look. We need to uh, go get something to eat somewhere, don't we? I don't think it's... She's found a bloody Gordon Ramsay place now. Oh, it's gone. They've turned it off when you've come. It's not touch screen, though. There's one here, look. Beef Wellington for 210 quid. What? Are you kidding me? Yeah. The other stuff's not as bad. <sighs> no, let's not. What's your thoughts, darling? We're outside this place called The Real Greek, and it's not as pricey as some other places. And we're at a point now where we're at death's door, aren't we, love? What about Co oh. what's Cosmo? Is that, is that a restaurant? It's probably a shop. We can't just keep looking at different places. Oh, okay. Let's, let's go just in go here, in then. here and yeah. have some Greek food. 
As long as they're the chips, <laughs> chips and beer will be all right. Chips and beer. It's going from bad to worse, isn't it, Owen? Uh, yes. Bookings only. They weren't even that busy. Where are we going, sweetheart? Wait a minute. And well, she didn't even have a look. She, yeah, she? she weren't bothered. Hey, wow, it's got five. Right, we're at the end of our tether now, literally, aren't we? Well, <laughs> not the end of his tether. I mean, we're, 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 we're shattered. Just very we're tired, aren't shattered. We? So, you know, you'll have to bear with us. Well, I'm not filming full drill like that now. I just can't, Why? Be, just can't be bothered. People need to say. I'm so tired. We've come to I'll this film place. It. It's a steakhouse, and we're just having a burger and chips, and then we've got to head home, haven't we? Yeah. But we need to do this final thing. Uh, I'll film you when you come from there. I want to know what your thoughts on Liverpool are. Do you know what I've just thought then? Yeah. What, can you remember that, what is it? Final thoughts, who was it? Final, oh it would. Uh, Jerry Springer. Jerry Springer. <laughs> right Jerry, what's your final thoughts? I've, I've loved Liverpool, it's been amazing, it's a lot better than I thought it would be and it's huge and all the buildings and restaurants and bars and everyone's yeah. been really really friendly, all the people we've spoken to, we've spoken to lots of uh, locals and all the quirky pubs, we've it's probably wonderful. only seen a very very small fraction Yeah, you need what. you need a long time don't you, yeah. see. you yeah. need at least three or four days. Yeah, ask me now. Film me. Come on, be professional. Oh, oh, oh lovely. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks very much. So, James, uh, in a little nutshell, I'd like you <laughs> a to just nutshell. a little nutshell. I'd like you to critique your weekend in Liverpool. The highlights, the best bits, the the not so good bits, the best pub. Go for it. <laughs> <laughs> we'll wait for you to finish then. <laughs> so, for ages people have been saying in comments and messages, you've got to come to Liverpool. If you're a, I know quite a few are subscribers from Liverpool, and they're saying you've got to come to Liverpool. And for some reason, and I don't know why, maybe I'm weird, it's just never sort of appealed to me. I don't know why. It's like I've not really been to Manchester either, but... Do you know what it is? I, I don't know. It's the Pennines that are in the way. It's on Pennines. Yeah. Well, it sort of appealed to me, but I love it. I, I, oh, what a great city, absolutely it love it. Is. The, the people are amazing. We've met so many lovely, friendly yeah. people. Just just random people in pubs talking to them and stuff like that. The pub life is some of the best I've seen, yeah. really. Just pub after pub of quirky bars. There's, there's something for everybody. There and then is. there's all the culture and the museums. Yeah. And brilliant, absolutely brilliant place. So yeah, I'd definitely come again and I would recommend it. If you're gonna to come to Liverpool, if you've not been, you need a few days really, don't you? Yeah, you do. Because we've rushed around these two days. I know the first day we're just a booze up, but I know a lot of people like to do that. Uh, you need a few days, don't you really? So there you go, that's the verdict. So anyway, thanks for watching this video all these two videos don't forget to subscribe don't forget to like and all that thank you very much we'll see you in the next one so it's goodbye from me <laughs> and it's goodbye from her <laughs> it's, go it, it's goodbye from her indoors <laughs> all right love see you there <laughs>